At a time when competitive gaming was far from being the worldwide phenomenon it is today, one player rose to the highest ranks of the StarCraft scene, Lim Boxer Yo Huan. He became one of the most popular professionals for his creativity, innovative strategies, and over-the-top micromanagement. With his insane skills, he turned the Terran race from the weakest faction into a winner's choice, revolutionizing the way the Terrans are being played and inventing strategies still used today. He, you know, they call him the Emperor, and, and he, he is yes. like a leader of a legacy of a game that changed a Boxer dominated the scene for years, winning two WCG and Star League championships as well as the KPGA Tour, and also forming the highly successful team SK Telecom T1. Even getting conscripted by the Korean Air Force could not stop his passion for the game. And while in service, he formed the first Korean Armed Forces eSports team, Air Force Challenge eSports, together with several other pro gamers. He continued his career after his service, shaping the StarCraft scene even further as player and coach of SK Telecom T1. And after switching from Brood War to StarCraft II, once again as founder of a successful team, Slayers, an organization that would win the prestigious Global StarCraft II Team League two times in a row. But fans of the RTS genre will mostly remember him for his dominance during the formation period of professional StarCraft competition.